The number of significant digits in a measurement is important, especially in calculations. The computed results of experiments can only be as accurate as the actual measurements. We have a general rule for calculations involving multiplication and division. The product or quotient may contain only as many significant figures as the measurement with the least number of significant figures. Look at this calculation. The first number has only three significant figures. The second number being multiplied has seven. Following our rule, we may not use this answer which has seven significant figures. The measurement with the least number of significant figures is three, as in 1.13. So the product should be reported as 5.79 meters squared, which also has three significant figures. The general rule for adding and subtracting is that the sum or difference may contain only as many decimal places as a measurement having the least number of decimal places. Let us suppose that to calculate the result of an experiment, we have to add these numbers. The sum has three decimal places. This means that this sum has a certainty greater than that of the least certain measurement, which is 677. 0.1 grams. The measurement with the least decimal places, in this case 677.1 grams, has only one decimal place. The sum we report should then have only one decimal place, 722.6 grams.